back to Mobile for Boxing UK. I'm here with Ishmael Salas, legendary trainer. How are you doing, sir? I'm uh, doing very well. Thank you so much. Another big fight night in London. You've had a few of those. Yeah, it is. You know, um, this this fight for for us, for all our team. No, your Joyce, myself, everyone is mean uh, because everybody knows. Soon after, we will fight with the big, big fight. One of the one of them, the, the uh, top three uh, heavyweight. And to someone else, they say, "Okay, let me do easy fight and standing by." You know, but uh, to me, it's more important to have him this kind of fight right now to make him ready to coming to whoever coming in next. And um, uh, he been doing, uh, he been very serious in this camp. He been doing like uh, three months uh, training camp down there in in Las Vegas. We did pre training camp and training camp, so it been quite long with us in Las Vegas. So just to be ready for Saturday night. Yeah, because a lot of people would say Zhang is not an easy fight. He's already nah, the interim champion. Not. He didn't need this fight, but he's taking it. It yeah. just kind of goes to show what he's looking to do in the future. But if you if you look your Joyce, you know the way they because his age, so the way they took the shortcut to get where he is in right now. He been he been fighting with tough fighter, with tough. You never take easy fight. You remember Christian Hammer yeah. and then Joseph Parker. No one before. Uh, uh, stop Joseph Parker. Yeah, first time. Uh, uh, Joe, Joe stopped him. And Joseph Parker did with uh, AJ. He did with all the best. And he is a great. But we took it. Like, like right now, you know. No, many people say, oh, you should not take the fight because it's too risky. Yeah. And I know uh, you saw the uh, him last fight with uh, against the Hegovic, the Philip Hegovic. Yeah. Man. To me, he won the fight. Close fight, very close fight. You, you know what I mean? But if you cannot risk, you cannot profit. It's the higher risk. The bigger rewards. Yes. So, of course, it shows to be successful on Saturday and get through this. There's only a few names left I can think of for the big, for the big one. No, the big one, they, as everybody knows, they have a, a Tyson Fury. Uh, we have a, a, a Yusik. And we have uh, AJ if he like to come to Overway. We focus in these main three. Which one would be your favorite? Which one would you like the most to get out of those three? Now, if I tell you, the biggest name is Tyson Fury. But if I think about AJ, for us it will be a good night. Of course, not looking past Zhang. Zhang's a more incredible opponent. What have you implemented in Joe this time round? Because all of your training camps are very creative. You train specifically for the fighters. What's the key to the big bang? Okay. Uh, right now, we have two, two directions. Number one, we train with Larry Wells. Larry White. And Larry put on the point I need to for this fight. Endurance, reaction time. So... To do both, we need to bring Joy a lighter than than five before. So yes. everybody will see your Joy is a, a slimming than than before. I think a lot of people realize when Joe came in earlier on, he was a lot trimmer. He was definitely a lot more slimline. Yes, yeah, because of the of the training of the guiding by uh, Larry. Larry really is a very very professional fitness trainer for me. He's best fitness trainer. So, of course, you've been with Joe throughout the camp in Las Vegas. How do you see this fight going? How do you predict it? Man, Jojo is the kind of fighter he chose. He can go 12 rounds and no problem. He can go one round, no problem. Because he's... We, we, we one thing, one, always my way of thinking with my fighter, we have to be ready for whatever coming to overweight. If the guy go down nicely, very good. But if we have to fight the, the 12 round, we will fight 12 round. So either way, a first round destruction job or a 12 round back and forth, Joe is ready. Yeah, he's ready, ready. And 
once he gets this fight, how soon do you think it could be till Joe lands that world title shot that he's been aiming for? Well, uh, say again, I'm sorry. Um, after this fight, how long do you think? Ah, Joe how long? Okay, okay I got it. I fight? got it. So what? Main is depend of who who can be ready for how it's going. Yeah, how are you? My main. Yeah. Uh, anyway, uh, it's up to you know if Tyson Fury is ready for within three months. Welcome. But uh, up to me. Before I think about something else, I have to be focused in next fight. Yeah. This Saturday. This Saturday is a, will be a turning point. Turning point. So I cannot plan now for the next when I didn't want to accomplish yet this coming fight. So let's let's accomplish and then we go and thinking what is what uh, for next. That's very understandable, Ishmael. So what we'll do is we'll get past Saturday night. And I'll talk to you on Saturday night about what the plan is next. Yeah. Once Joe has yes, and then after Saturday night we can sit and talk. If we can have a chat. No problem, Ishmael. Of course, all the best for you and Joe on Saturday. Yeah. And uh, thank we'll you. see you on fight night. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you very much. Yes.